Welcome to the RMM Plus installation guide video. We will guide you safely through two important steps to have the RMM Plus installed on a container. First, you must do some preparations to be able to install the RMM Plus. You must make sure that the container ID in the controller is correct. Also, we strongly recommend that you update your latest controller software, if not already so. You can check the container ID and the controller software version in the display on the carrier controller during the power on routine. When this information is checked, you must make sure to turn off the power to the container and unplug the reefer container connector. To perform the installation of the RMM Plus, you must have the required tools. You will need a 19mm drill, a marker, a drill for removing burrs, a cutting compound for the drill, degreasing racks, screwdrivers and side cutting pliers. Now unbox the RMM Plus and place the drill guide sticker centered below the container display. Mark the holes with a marker to make sure that the holes are drilled precisely. Make sure to keep the door open through this process so you don't get cuttings inside the controller box. Apply cutting compound to the power drill and drill the two 19mm holes below the display. When the holes are drilled, remove the drill guide sticker, remove burrs and degrease the surface before fitting the antenna. The antenna cable must be guided through the left hole. Mount the antenna using supplied PG11 nuts, which you must tighten firmly with a recommended torque of 2.5 Nm. Open the door completely and guide the cable from the antenna to the RMM Plus device. Use the cable binders to keep the antenna cable in place. If there's an existing modem installed, this must be removed. Remove it and reuse all the screws and locking discs. Fit the new RMM Plus modem with the screws. Make sure that no cables are with tension. If there is no existing modem, you need to determine whether it is quarter turn or threaded screws that are needed. Connect the plugs for the antenna by matching the colors. The other three plugs are to be mounted in the respective sockets. Turn on the reefer and verify the functionality of RMM Plus by looking at the diagnostic LEDs. Verify that power LED is lit, which will be steady green. If it is not lit, check the 24 volt power supply on 3 pin connector. Also verify that the control LED has turned on within 2 minutes. Otherwise check the 7 pin connector. If the controller LED flashes, the controller has an invalid container ID. Please correct in the controller settings. When it is all verified, you have successfully installed the RMM Plus and you can place the RMM Plus modem install sticker according to shipping line instructions. You can find more information on our homepage amazonclimate.com ts